This video will demonstrate how a RabbitMQ service instance can be shared between two applications in a Cloud Foundry environment. We have two spaces in our Cloud Foundry org, Team 1 and Team 2. In the Team 1 space, we have a demo application called Publisher, which is able to publish messages to a Rabbit queue. Since I have installed the Pivotal RabbitMQ data service in my environment, I can now create a single node RabbitMQ instance called My Instance in the Team 1 space. This will take a few seconds to complete. Now I can bind my publisher application to the new service instance. I will restage the application so that it can pick up the service instance information that has been injected into the VCAP services environment variable. I'm now ready to share the service instance into the other space I have access to called team2. To do this I run cfv3 share service specifying the name of the space I want to share the service instance with. If I now target the team2 space I can check that this has succeeded as expected and I can see that the instance has been shared from the development org and team1 space. Just like in the other space I can now bind my demo application called receiver with the shared service instance. I'll restage the application so that it can pick up the credentials that it has been provided with. If I target the Team 1 space again, I can see that the service instance has been shared with space Team 2, and that one binding has been created in that space. The two demo applications that I have pushed demonstrate how their applications are successfully publishing and receiving messages using the same rabbit queue. To unshare the service instance and stop the application in the Team2 space from using the queue, I just run cfv3unshare service specifying the name of the space I want to unshare the instance from.